Thanks, Bob, and welcome to another Cast Iron Ranger. I'm Dan Brooks, and I'm here today at Fort Selden with Dave Harkness. And we've got a special treat for you today. This is end of season bird hunter surprise. And what I have in here is a variety of birds. I got some quail, I've got a couple of ducks, even got a band-tailed pigeon. And Dave's gonna show us a special recipe on how to cook this up. Well, thank you, Dan. And uh, what we're going to do today is, is a real basic recipe. Uh, back in the day, in the period of the fort, uh, game was, was a, 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 a real luxury to have. Uh, once in a while, somebody would go out and shoot, and especially birds. Birds were right. pretty, much, pretty prevalent, and they still are today in this area. So uh, what we're going to do is we're going to roast these up in a Dutch oven. Um, what we're going to do is braise them off first in a little bit of lard in the bottom of that hot oven. And then we're going to put some spices on them. I've got my special spice mix here. Now, I don't know if I should tell my secrets. Tell them your secrets. All right, I'll go ahead and tell them my secrets here. But uh, what I've got here is a mixture of um, uh, green chili and red chili powders. I got some garlic and I have a little black pepper. And uh, the special the special part is, is cinnamon and ginger. Mm -hmm. Those are very good spices to use, especially with, uh, with games, gamey meats. Uh, we're going to put some of that on these birds, and then we're going to we're going to put a little blanket of salt pork on top of them, and that'll help baste them while they're cooking and keep them nice and moist. So that meat doesn't dry out. A lot of the game is going to be dry meat, and this larding meat with salt pork was very popular in the period. Still is today. Yes, and we've got a spit going with coals under it and a Dutch oven on top, so that's already ready. So we've done some of our prep work. What do you need me to do now? Well, I th think what you ought to do is let's go ahead and just throw these birds in All that right. pot and braise them off and, uh, and we'll get her started Mighty. here. Part of the secret is Dave's already put a little lard in the bottom here. It's only been about five, seven minutes, but these are brown and ready to go, and I bet Dave will be here any moment. How are we doing there, Dan? Oh, your timing's perfect. Well, I brought you a pan. We can throw All those right. birds in. They're looking that. really good. Aren't they? to the next step, Dave. All right, we're all ready here. Let's go ahead and why don't you put those birds for me in this basket. And this is gonna be, it's gonna make it a lot easier for us to mm. handle these birds. Yes. Especially because they're so small. Okay, and then we're gonna put some spices on them. And I'm not gonna overdo it. But we want, we want to fight a little bit of that gaminess, and this will give it a nice little flavor. Yeah. And you don't measure that out either. You just no, not, it on. Not, not something like this, no. And uh, then we're going to go ahead and put some salt pork. Now, I buy mine, it's already pre sliced. You sure. You can't buy idea. it in a big chunk. But, right. And it's pretty salty stuff. You cook this stuff up, it looks a lot like bacon, but it, trust me, it's salty. And when it, the way it comes, oftentimes there'll be a, the skin is still on it, the uh -huh. rind, if you will. Uh -huh. And you gotta trim that part off. But we're just gonna lay them right on top of these birds. And it's gonna just baste these things nicely as they cook. I better not step too close to that. I'll <laughs> catch my, well, my foot on fire, huh? Woo! All right. Well, name your poison. Okay, I want a quail for sure. I might even want more than a quail. But I'm taking a quail. Is that all right? You go right ahead. You all dig right. right in. I am, right there. 
I got one. I think I'll, I'll, think I'll go right with you there on that. <laughs> All right. So we can just dig in. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Ooh. Mm hmm. Oh, that's hot. Or blow on it, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I can. Pretty tasty. It is. That's very good. Bon appetit. Yes, and thanks for this uh, end of hunter bird surprise. Well, thanks for sharing the meal with me. <laughs> All right.